what's going on you guys it's renita and i'm back with another reaction video this time someone um requested for me to react to floyd mayweather highlights um so yeah i'm interested to see this one because i'm i mean like everybody's heard of floyd mayweather like i know who he is obviously and i've seen a couple of his fights but i haven't seen all of them so um, I'm interested to see these highlights. The link to the original video will be down in the description. And yeah, so let's get right to it. Again, former junior lightweight, former lightweight, former super lightweight, former super welterweight world champion, the reigning, defending, undefeated welterweight champion of the world, pretty boy Floyd, a.k.a. Money Mayweather. I tell a motherfucker like this. I'm at the top. When, I, when I'm at the top, I ain't trying to look at who's behind me. I'm leading the way. Motherfucker, you got to worry about getting in my spot. It's Floyd Mayweather. That just kind of caught me for a loop. I was, um... I, don't, I just wasn't expecting that. I expected it to be all highlights of him in the ring, but I guess because he's so much of a character outside of the ring, too. I don't know if he still acts like that. Probably not, but I know the reputation that he had um, of being such a, like, just super-duper arrogant and everything like that. So, I guess that's why they had to add highlights of his probably craziest moments outside of the ring too i just wasn't expecting that i thought it was about to be all in the ring but that's okay that might make it even more interesting i don't know so sorry put my glasses on um uh, <laughs> okay let's finish I didn't say that kind of caught me off guard i don't know if it caught y'all off guard too but i just wasn't expecting that Mr. HBO himself live and living color 24 7. come on give me some of that face-to-face -face action you know you find the best, right? You willing to die? You a pussy. And I'm the top draw. You remember that? You can't be too good, guys. I chose to be the bad guy. Fuck you. I'm going to beat you till you respect me. I'm going to beat you. I'm going to make you call me pretty. I'm going to beat you. Like that. I'm still going to beat his ass. Three years for that chance. The truth. And they stick their middle finger up, basically saying, fuck you. So I stuck my middle finger back up. He said, fuck y'all. There's only one. It's easy work. You boys can't beat me. You will never be able to beat me. Never. Never. On your greatest day. Never. If all a person got in their in bank account right now is a million dollars. They've been on Oscar. They're going to be a broke, they're going to be a broke motherfucker. But when you betting on Floyd Mayweather, that's for sure money. So when you ask me, I tell you, put your money under your mattress and keep it till July 18th. I'm going to talk your trash. Huh. We'll see. He really had to believe in himself because when you talking that much trash, like, wouldn't you be nervous about, like, when they had that face, I don't know what that's called, but when they had that face-to-face -face moments, the fighters, right before they about to, um, I don't know if that's like the day before they about to fight, or I know it'd be soon before they about to fight. When you talking all that trash, like, wouldn't you be nervous that that's gonna just motivate the other person to just, like, Think about all that stuff you said when they get into the ring, you know. But he always backed up the stuff he said. I mean, it, it. it's like, I wonder, did he do that on purpose to give himself more motivation? Like, because I done talked all this trash, now I have to back it up. So, I don't know. Whatever he, the reason he did it, it worked, clearly. I mean, he won all the time. But that's just crazy. I would be like thinking about that like oh, i don't want to talk too much and they have to eat my words later you know because that would be so embarrassing but clearly he believed in himself and knew what he could do and knew he was better go ahead floyd <laughs> I wrote all them raps because I was in 
things to do. All of my dreams have all been shattered. Rain raps is like glass in my prime. Signs of claim sex, we one of the few left that ain't riding the west. Ain't dick sucking the south, you still a get punched to your mouth. You ever fuck around, luck fuck em down. I like the way that sound, luck fuck em down. I fuck em the fuck out of this duck knuckle down. I uppercut the sucker, the fucker gonna touch the ground. Since two down, I came with another stab. My shit was sharp then, just like rubber ab. But I was never rocking the perm. If I was anything, I try to teach the people not gonna learn. I could try to take the popular turn Rap about a bunch of bullshit It's not really not my concern Or well, I could do some old dumb shit To come with the melody Nigga, I know the game What the fuck is you telling me? I love this hip-hop shit Nigga, you smelling me How else could a nigga get rich With two felonies? Niggas flows is dookie. I flip styles like one of them old Suzuki. A show Kazuki burning whoever closest to me. I verbalize beat that y'all eat. Lay it back on the concrete. Rip open your chest and rhyme to your heartbeat. Niggas can't resist to put the palm first. If I am what I eat, then I guess that I'm every whack lyricist on earth. The form works. Couldn't really explain in the song verse. Hack the families and the people I put in that long hearse. Oh, now we flip and listen to some other different shit. Real niggas, come get your certificates if you interested. First off, we gon' build this abandoned nation citizenship. Prison don't even miss. It. If you ain't experienced it, this is some serious shit. Go ahead, think of playing it. See what you're saying when it's a puddle with blood you laying in. You're kidding me, you're literally the epitome, your verbal validity. Look, nigga, see what life did to me. Turn me colder than my older raps, colder than polar caps, colder than comical perhaps without no look back. I used to cook crack, they took that. I learned a jokes cat, where the brook at? We got this shit locked, put that back. A new Gibby is back in full effect. Fuck around, you gon' get my hands wrapped around your neck. Respect to all the kids that's still trapped in the jets. I'm a rat, watch how much of this cash I'ma collect. Yep. I know who really wanna know who's coming from leaving blunt state. It just be like he be moving so fast. Like, oh my goodness, he just be moving so fast. I love, I like watching him fight. Like, I like I said, I've only watched him probably. I watched the Pacquiao fight. And there was another one, like, maybe two or three years before that one. I don't ask who, I don't remember. But, um, I like watching him fight because it's, like, almost like a show. Like, the arrogance, the, like, that one move he did in that one little highlight that the show where he'd be, like, you know, letting his guard down, unblocking his face, and egging the other fighter on. Like, come on, come on, you know? Like, all of that is part of why you want to go see Mayweather fight, you know? Well, me anyway. I like the arrogance. I like watching all that. It just makes it more of a show, I guess, for the people who aren't so die-hard boxing fans. It's even interesting for somebody like me to watch because it's like, oh, look at this, you know? I don't know. <laughs> I just like watching it. This is this is pretty dope. Catching on the point we made in the first round. He yeah. looks wound up and tight. Very... There's a hard right hand. And that may be the hardest punch that Floyd Mayweather has taken in recent years. He's, he's smiling about it, but Shane Mosley landed a right cross. And crunchingly so. Mosley's loosening up. The crowd is coming alive. And we've got a fight for a moment here. Mosley, Mosley, Mosley. Another big right hand. Mayweather's knees buckled on the second right hand. Mosley drives him into the ropes. Tries to go to the body. Mayweather defending well as always. Mark, check it out. Mark, check it out. Mark, check it out. It don't stop. It don't stop. Watch the hit nigga. It don't stop. It don't stop. Watch the hit nigga. Dirty. Harry. Big 
chopper, throwing niggas off a cliff, smoking splits, disappear with my bitch, in the Mitsubishi eclipse, read my lips, I kill you, blood is spilled too, did I say thank you, I grant you, three wishes cause I be the genie, niggas is ass out like fat bitches in bikinis, read between the lines, see what I see, I see the diary of a sick bastard, junior mafia blaster, rugas on the hips, what coke to flip chips, what bullets to fill clips, check it, putting coke in corner store bodegas, in the back room playing Sega, Street Fighter 2, I'm inviting you, get your writing crew, and they dopest rhymes, I get up in that ass every time. Still undefeated, Lord. Ask yourself this question. Have many pack y'all ever lost? Yes. Have many pack y'all ever been knocked out? Yes. Have Floyd Mayweather ever lost? No. Have I ever been have I ever been knocked out? No. Have I ever been knocked down? No. Okay. That's not my job to know who should pack y'all fight. If pack y'all wanna fight, all like all we gotta do is get uh uh Marquez a million dollars a million dollars to step aside money and tell him he can fight the winner, which will be me. Well, he was right. Um, <laughs> that was cool. I mean, wow. I don't know. I don't remember exactly when his fight is that's coming up in August. I know I'll be watching it, though. It's somebody's fight party somewhere. Um, yeah, I like watching him fight, even though I've seen a lot of interviews of, like, real boxing people saying that this fight coming up in August is almost like a joke and it's not um it does nothing for boxing and all of that I don't really care I just know it's a Floyd Mayweather fight and it's a reason to go out and enjoy yourself so I'll be watching we all be watching maybe no I don't know Anyway, I like this video. If you liked it too, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to visit the link in the description of the original video if you want to watch it um, without me talking over it. And yeah, uh, keep commenting. Tell me what you want me to react to. And be sure to subscribe so you can see all my reactions. And I'll see you guys for the next one. Bye.